Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Pasty Just Skin here watching Brotherhood from Final Fantasy XV. Yeah, the, um, the series got a few episodes up now, and it's kind of... Uh, I've been enjoying the hell out of it. It's uh, been interesting. With the previous episode, we saw Gladiolus and Prompto, and of course, uh, a kind of an introduction to the situation that they're currently in with um, a battle that's ongoing with a creature that attacked Noctis whenever he was a kid and killed his mother and has apparently came back again to finish the job. So on their next step through this little kind of like uh, world kind of history and the reason why this brotherhood has came together as a group to work together, we're going to be looking at Ignis, who seems to be kind of like the, the, the moral head, the, um, the, thoughtful, the thoughtful head that kind of like makes sure this body, these limbs of people kind of work well together. So um, we're going to jump into episode four, Bittersweet Memories, and have a wee watch of that. So of course my controller decides to drop out just the moment that we're actually going to, about to sit down and watch it. Typical. So here we go, episode four, Bittersweet Memories. So, um... From what we could see, we've seen that uh, Prompto is the heart, uh, Gladiolus is the strong arms, and I think Ignis is the head of this kind of group. It's uh, the head of this little group organization, Brotherhood. He's the one who kind of like four plans, four thinks, prepares, and keeps everybody together while they all kind of like have their own little quirks and annoyances. He seems the most blandest of the characters, but I think it's actually the fact that it's just because he is the most even and well thought, well, well prepared and thought out person. He's like, he's planned for everything he possibly can because it's his way of controlling the situation. And uh, with a character like Noctis who can turn on a dime and the people around him and the situation they're in, it's probably the best person to have. So. Maybe I think I, I just think he balances this whole team well as a personality. So let's see how that applies out to the bittersweet memories of how him and Noctis kind of came to be this close. We have seen a single scene with Noct uh, with uh, Ignis previously. Whenever he uh, Noctis was at school, he was actually his driver. But I imagine that was kind of like almost the scene in Gladiolus where they were just people who worked amongst the, the, the royal castle and the, the government kind of organization and stuff. It seemed to be like a bit of a right hand man for the, um, the royal family. So let's see how they kind of specifically relate to Noctis, of course. Okay, let's go. Even the simplest things, just like give them a heads up like, when to be back. Ooh. Hey, baby. <laughs> Not the best pickup artist in the world, but eh, didn't do too bad there. それと、ブラックペッパーを2袋。あ、いいよ。うん。そのままでもいいが、ジャムにしてもうまいよ。うん。では、これも頼む。オッケー。何作ってんだ?お、いつものやつか。今回はバナナで試してみる。バナナ。
<laughs> Nokto yo yu jan? <laughs> Extra credit for being the friends. See, that would be really convenient, <laughs> but uh, probably not. Please play on the battle zone. Well, I suppose. I mean, it's actually, if you got the power and you went from prince to king, you could just go like, no more exams for children. <laughs> This really feels like um proper kind of like teenage reaction. Manga nara tana ni osameta. Luna Frena sama no techo wa hiki dashi da. Henji o suru nara hayai hou ga ii. Akatte de yo. Botan ga ochite ita ga are wa. No. Seifuku no yatsu? Ochite ta? Mattaku. Kaette tsukeru kara dashite oite kure. It feels like he really does. He's he's pretty much Noctis's nursemaid at this point. Feeding them, cleaning them, making sure. Like, uh, essentially covering for the basic necessities and needs that make this person manage to survive. Feels very, very subservient. どうだ。うーん、違うかな。もっと甘かったし、サクサクしてた気がする。そうか。パイ生地の方も試作が必要か。でもうまいよ。イグニスも食わねえ。コーヒーは。うん。サンキュー。See。試験勉強があるだろうから帰るか。It's not like an inconsideration. It's actually like guys,筋は閉じまりに気をつけてください。I'm looking for just an expectation that this guy's going to tie all this crap for him. うん。それとゴミの分別も頑張ってくれ。それ以前に部屋に放置するな。Imagine him just being constantly asking guys to do anything right. 誰かがやってくれるとは大間違いだぞ。うん。ノックと、はいはい。yeah, yeah, I'm not even making eye contact with you. So that's essentially what it is. It's, uh, he's he's kind of like the, the guy teaching Noctis how to be a politician, how to actually go through his day to day work, but also have to pretty much like drag him step by step through it. Fair enough. ゲーノクト勉強してる。何食ってんの？あ、そうなんじゃ。え、え、え。ブレックフォースウィーディーズ。ああ。一口だけ。ほっ。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん
わった終わったおい明日もあるだろテスト一日で十分だよあ陛下だった、うん、あれ陛下って足悪かったっけいや、yeah, you see it's one of those noticeable things the public appearance by the king like and of course like the he, like he's one of the, he's a son he's actually not paying enough attention so he's like that would, that would catch you off guard and then I'm having plenty of questions I'm sorry 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 ワイシャツのボタンをつけたから届けてきた、yeah. それと、so、昨日渡したレポートは読んだかまだ読んだ形跡がなかった帝国の大規模な戦争は30年前に一時収束したが未だ予断を許さない状況だ報道規制されているが現に小規模の衝突は時折起こっているルーシス150年の平和は、大多数の力に入れてくれる魔法障壁のおかげだ。王は多大な力を消費し、その代償をすべて恩見に引き受けられる。レギス様はしばらく前線に出ず、魔法障壁に集中するとおっしゃっていた。もうほとんど武器召喚はできないらしい。それ今聞かなきゃいけないことは。では、でいつ聞くんだ。言っただろう。お前は次期国王なんだ。いずれ。親父が死ぬって。そう言ってんだろ。俺が王になるのは親父が死ぬ時だ。落ち着け。ただ事実を。事実ってなんだよ。話にならないな。だが、考えておいてくれ I love the fact that the House of the Dead series has still managed to survive throughout to whatever alternate reality this is. In. Bebe, go! That's excellent. It's actually looks like a gym teacher, but yeah. I'm going to go to the gym teacher. So, seeing how the actual combat is, and probably we should work for whatever using the sword. Big dodges. Since you're talking him into it or talking him down, I suppose. I mean, that's what I imagine that's what Gladio is kind of like become as well. Like, uh, not just a physical trainer, but also kind of like a. Um, Mental and moral support, give him the strength that he needs to actually be able to do the things he needs to do, while Ignis kind of tells him what it is he needs to do. Yeah. They're both aware of it, Ling. Come on, man. Mata Keiko Sabori saw that there. So let's go. I got that. I said you just tell him another thing he has to do. Jesus, this kid does nothing on his own. What are you thinking? I don't know. 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 The kid's aware. This is the fact that he's actually afraid. It makes a lot of sense.
なんだ何か燃やしたのか<笑>料理したのか Yeah, I tried to. Ma. Yep. Ma. <laughs> Ma. <laughs> From now onwards, I'm waiting time somebody asks me if I do anything. Ma. Ara, hello, ne. Ma. Ah, instant ramen. There's a reason why you have it, like. Student special, Bombay bad boy. Chicken and mushroom. Yeah, <laughs> man. That's exactly what you want. Ah, so. フライパンってもえないごめん。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。